Okay guys, so Lisa and I have decided to come out here tonight. Uh, we've had our supper, we had a bit of family time there, but now we're heading to a place that we recently discovered. Uh, we've been to it, very close to it before, but never knew that this actual spot existed. It's a place called Sunset Rock, uh, and that's in Bottle Cove, and that's uh, down in Lark Harbour. Uh, so it's about a 40 minute drive, uh, something like that, maximum. Uh, so we've had supper and we're just heading down to Lark Harbour now and we're going to try and see if we can capture a sunset. Uh, that was one of the seven things, remember, from my previous video that I said I wanted to capture. And uh, I must say it's looking very promising right now. Uh, so we, that's where we're heading. Um, I have discovered one major problem with Newfoundland uh, as far as photography goes and that is, uh, it's really difficult to decide where to point your camera. It's just absolutely stunning. Everywhere you look, uh, Lisa's just pointing out here, uh, she would call it over the bay or whatever there, <laughs> where she grew up. Um, it's the Bay of Islands. Uh, right now there's some trees there, so I can't really turn it around, uh, but I will in a second, and I'll show you a bit of the Bay of Islands as we drive down there. In the road. So yeah, uh, we'll catch you in a bit when we get down to uh, Bottle Cove and hopefully we'll capture that sunset. So as you can probably tell from that rather shaky handheld video there, uh, the road is quite bumpy, um, but the views are just spectacular, uh, and it looks like it really is gearing up to be an amazing sunset. So hopefully uh, that'll tick one of the boxes off. Well, maybe two, because I did a panorama today as well. But uh, yeah, this is uh, super exciting. Who knows, the cloud could cover over and we might lose the sunset, but it really is shaping up to be nice. Yeah, the sun coming over the top of these hills is just absolutely fantastic. And uh, we were going to stop and take a few photographs, but we're just going to venture on. We don't want to lose sight of this uh, the plan. We were coming out for the sunset, so we're going to, at the risk of not getting an image, we're going to go to Sunset Rock and hope that we get the shot that we're after. So like I said guys, it's uh, shaping up to be a spectacular sunset. We got probably an hour before the sun actually sets and we got about a 25-30 minute walk in here. But check this out guys, just check this out. Bottle Cove in Lark Harbour, look at that. And that's Sunset Rock, just on the top there. And it couldn't be an easier trail. Parking lot's just behind Lisa there. And it's about, you know, about a 35, 40 minute drive uh, from where we're staying at Lisa's sister's. And it's uh, the most glorious of nights. I'll catch you in a bit. So guys, we're about halfway up this uh, Sunset Rock Trail. Sunset Rock is up there behind me. Uh, you'll probably see some people up there. And there's some people 
just right over here too. That's the Bottle Cove Beach behind me. And there is a cave in the rock just behind those people there. But we really want to get up to the top there. Uh, just where those folks up there are on top of the hill. So guys, uh, absolutely uh, beautiful. Not as spectacular as we hoped, but still got some nice sunset shots. We did go up onto Sunset Rock, but then came back down to this little platform here, looking towards a the cave there, and looking out over the ocean towards the sunset. We did get a few shots, um, but I've heard a few photographers say, always look behind you. So as the sun was setting, we actually looked over towards the beach area here, and there was a bit of pink and stuff in the sky. Just lasted a few seconds. But certainly we will be coming back here at least one more time before our trip here is over. It's only a 30 minutes drive from where we're staying. So yeah, we will be back for sure. Uh, so that about wraps it up. If the shots are any good, they're in the gallery at the end. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one on my second full day. Don't know where we're going yet, but we'll be going somewhere. Cheers for now, and I'll see you in the next one. guys, uh, if you ever do find yourself in Lark Harbour, down the Bay of Islands in Newfoundland here, check out this little restaurant. Purples by the Bay. Best fish and chips I've tasted in such a long time. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, so we're heading back towards town now.
catch you in the next one.